Hello and welcome. In today's episode, I'm going to be making an air level at the top so that the dolphins can breathe in here because I, I can't have an aquarium without dolphins. So I thought about it for a bit and I thought let's use uh, I thought it was cool actually netherrack because you can mine it very quickly. Now I've got efficiency all four, so that kind of makes this quick work. I'm hoping, yeah. So this is the fastest way I can think of. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be leaving the furthest row of netherrack out so it doesn't flood back and then collecting all the bit behind it and then working on from there. So I've already messed that up a little bit, but yeah. Okay, so it turns out that this process isn't really that fast at all, but I'm getting there. You can see that two of these wandering tradespeople have spawned in here while I've been down here. I think the other one was up there. He climbed down. But yeah, it's going to happen eventually. It's just really taking a long time. Um, Before I move on to actually doing the turtles. Oh, yes. It doesn't have anything I want. Oh, it's, it's kicking off. Llamas, you spit on each other and the zombie. Oh my god, look at this guy. He's mining the time of his life. Mine, mine that stuff. Rack that nether, put it in your back pocket. Na, 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 na. Oh, I'm sorry, mate. You're about to go a little grey. But it's for dolphins, so... Old age can't hurt that much, can it? Because dolphins literally can't breathe without you getting grey hair. Sorry, mate. <laughs> okay, so it's crazy, it seems. Doing all the way to here has taken longer than it took to build the entire wall around this thing. This is dragging on and on, and it's completely ruined this pick. Easily fixable, and luckily, I'm amazing. So, I have a spare. Bang in! Okie dokie, it took a few hours, but it is dolphin ready! No, it's not actually, I need to do the doors, but first I'm going to repair my pick, so I'll see you during that! Seems to be a couple of spiders in here. So, let's fix this bad boy. I might have my old gear off. Yeah. Well, this is, this is lag. This is what happens you go for a cup of tea. I'll wait for spiders to spawn. Oh my god. How are there still spiders? I've nearly repaired my view. I can repair the other one as well. Oh, there we go. Oh my god, there's been a few spiders in here. Oh, actually, you know, I'm not supposed to get some more string. Oh, coming down to the dregs. Wow. Mm -hmm. The only problem with doing it that way, yeah, is I do not get anywhere near as much string. Right, let's fix these doors. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'm going to do something. So let's just start doing it. Um, let's make a little tunnel, actually. I'm probably going to move the door back into the middle of the tunnel and have uh, the fence posts you can see in my inventory for each way so that... Yeah, let's do that. That sounds like a brilliant idea. Like that. And then we'll have the door in the middle. I wish I had my underwater... I do have an underwater axe somewhere. I believe there's one in here. I am the best around. Someone's going to knock this door down. Right, let's take that back in. Let's take it back in. Please be the silk touch. Yeah. Okay, here's the plan. The plan. Oh no. There we go. Why won't it why didn't it place originally? What's that about? Is it lag? Okie dokie. So fish should not be able to get through there. God, this is beautiful. Just extras, extras everywhere. And that's the airlock. 
Wonderful. That's one down. I'm going to do the other ones off camera. And then we're going to get some dolphins in this joint. Oh my god, we had our first customer. I didn't even have to go look for him. He's come to us. Dolphin. Now, can you even get through my new contraption? So open it all up. Even the trout want to come in. Come on. Down. Nearly. Oh, this is going to be difficult. Right, let's go outside again. If I can. Okay. You need to come right behind me. Yeah? Oh my god. One dolphin. Now you should be able to breathe in here. I'm going to get two more. I'm going to name you something. And then we'll see how it goes from there. I love you. Get you some brains. Oh, hi, little fella. Right. Let's see if it works. I only got three in the end. I actually nearly had five, but uh, actually impossible. They they just leave too easily. You're going to be called Eleven. Well done. Uh, oh, who are you? You're going to be Hopper. Oh, oh, you're going to be... No one wants to be Hopper. Right. Steve? You want to be Steve. That's 11. Oh, for God. For the love of God. My dolphins hate me already. It's 11 again, isn't it? Oh, my God. They're so quick. Stop it. Stop it. Oh, I'm never going to name them. 11's anyone who actually gets close enough. <laughs> Steve? Hop. Hopper? Or is that 11 again? Hopper! Right, got my dolphins. You can see that one's going for for air. Six. Yes. Dolphin friendly aquarium. Me and my dolphins. Right, next step, we're gonna start working on the turtle sanctuary. So we'll have uh, some sandstone here, heading down into the water. Up there, we'll have just just normal sand because that's where they have to lay their eggs. And then I'm going to bring two in. I've got a spare egg from the time when I bred them when they first came out. And I'm going to put them down and I'm going to feed them seagrass until the cows come home. Probably going to block them in with a bit of fence at first. And then I'll take that out once I've got some eggs. And then they can swim around here freely. And if they need to come up for air and chill out, they've got their sanctuary area. And that should be the end of this episode. Right. Let's do that. Not looking perfect at this moment, but it's ready. Let's take this torch out. I'm going to say that these lights are incubator lights because we have an egg. Oh, it's happy with this as well. Getting all those green th <gasps> Well, let's go get some other turtles as well. I have some shears with me, shears with me. Come with me, you will be in a glass place with no exit. Alrighty then, I have some good news, I have some bad news. I do have two turtles. Now, I've actually tried filming getting them up here about four times now, but turtles, turtles are rubbish. They're designed poorly. So when you get them to come up to here with your grass, all they do is just knock into this and then they go underneath. Hey, this, this guy this guy can probably help out. It's going to work this time, I can, I can probably tell. Come up. They just don't get it. They, they literally do. They only stay down. But if they do come up to the right level, they just they can't climb. They generally can't climb up here. Watch him, and he's underneath again. So there's only one way to fix this. It's gonna be very, what's well, a lot of hours, a lot of resources. But I'm gonna use stone and build down from those points. Actually making it safe for the, for the dolphins. It's gonna go down all the way to the ground. And I'm gonna have little tears coming up the sides. And the reason I'm going to have tears at the side is because they look ugly without them. And with those, I can grow kelp from the bottom and on different levels of the way up, obscuring it, making it look like a grassy kind of cove. So it, and it, I think it will actually look nicer in the end. It's just longer before I can breed my beautiful turtles. So once again, it has slowed down the progress of the aquarium. Right, I'm going to get on that now then. This is what I've come up with. Um... I think it looks pretty good. Uh, for the other one, I might try and make the little tiers a little bit higher. Because I'm making sure it kind of covers it fully. Or do I? I don't know. But I think it adds a little bit to the place. Because obviously it needs to be fully decorated. But yeah, now it, now it looks like it's a 
yeah, it's kind of meant to be there. Might have to do some more stuff with this. But obviously I can't put a ledge on it, otherwise the dolphins would drown themselves. But, other good news. An egg. An egg. The other one hatched. Can't find where it went. But, this time, definitely will see it. So, yeah. I guess I'm going to crack on with the other one. And, uh, and I'll show you what I've got when I'm finished. Wonderful. And voila. It is finished. The turtles can climb up. However, weird. Lee enough. The turtle I've nicknamed Morty is just immobilized. This one is already fed as well, so it's actually ready to have eggs. It just decides it doesn't want to move anymore. So it just sits there, floating away. And that's Morty. Here is Jessica with the egg that was over there. I moved her to here. With this one. And yeah, I've closed it off so that I can actually continue to breed them within this. Get lots of turtles, even though it's a long process because I can't find any other ones and Morty's kind of letting this side down. Uh, other than that, I've put some, uh, what are they called? Sea cucumbers? Yeah, I was going to say a sea cucumber down the floor to try and light up a bit. Didn't actually have enough, so I'm going to have to go get some more. Uh, preferably, I'll buy them from a vendor for expensive, expensive prices. But yeah, I think they kind of add something to it, actually. I'm kind of happy with them. Yeah. Oh, and we've got the three dolphins. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, the next episode will be going to a coral reef and filling my inventory with buckets of tropical fish to put in here. If you have any ideas on how to improve the area, then please do tell me, because I'd love to make this a pretty space. But obviously, keep in mind, anything from the ceiling will cause dolphins to drown. And everyone can pray that Morty moves again. Alright, boy!